He was just a kid, they say. A kid who would become one of the most infamous outlaws in the history of the American West. A kid with a gun. But not just any gun. A cult peacemaker. The weapon that would become synonymous with his name. That's how the stories often start. Whispered around campfires, under the vast, star-studded sky of the Wild West. Tales of his daring escapades, his narrow escapes, and his uncanny ability to outsmart the law. The Stories of Billy the Kid A young man who, despite his age, became a legend. He was a legend in his own time. His name was known far and wide, from dusty frontier towns to bustling cities. A young man who lived fast and died young, leaving behind a trail of tales and a whole lot of mystery. Billy the Kid His life was a whirlwind of action, danger, and intrigue. The name itself conjures up images. Images of a fearless young man, ready to face any challenge that came his way. A steely-eyed young man with a cult peacemaker on his hip. A symbol of defiance and rebellion in a time when the West was wild and untamed. He was a figure of both fascination and fear. To some, he was a hero, standing up against corrupt authorities. To others, he was a ruthless outlaw, a menace to society. A symbol of the Wild West's untamed spirit. A time when the line between right and wrong was often blurred, and survival meant bending the rules. Was he a cold-blooded killer? A man who took lives without a second thought? Or was he a misunderstood product of a lawless era? A young man trying to find his way in a world that offered him few choices. One thing's for sure, Billy the Kid's story is one heck of a ride. A tale filled with action, drama, and a touch of mystery that continues to captivate us to this day. And that's what we're gonna do now, partner. We're gonna dive deep into the life and times of Billy the Kid, separating fact from fiction. Saddle up and get ready to hear the true story of this Western outlaw. A story that will take you on a journey through the heart of the Wild West, where legends were born and history was made. Picture this, 1800s America, a time when the nation was expanding westward, driven by the promise of new beginnings and untapped riches. The frontier is wide open, stretching as far as the eye can see, inviting settlers and adventurers alike. It's a wild land, full of opportunity and danger in equal measure. The landscape is as diverse as the people who inhabit it, from towering mountains to arid deserts. It's a time when lawmen were scarce, and justice was often served with a hot lead bullet. The rule of law was tenuous at best, and many took it upon themselves to enforce their own brand of justice. This was the Wild West. Towns sprang up overnight, bustling with saloons, general stores, and the ever-present saloon girls and gamblers. The West was a melting pot. People from all walks of life converged here, each with their own dreams and aspirations. Miners, ranchers, cowboys, and gunslingers, all chasing their own version of the American dream. The miners sought gold and silver, the ranchers and cowboys worked the land and herded cattle, while the gunslingers sought fame and fortune through their prowess with a firearm. But amidst the promise and prosperity, there was a dark side. The allure of easy money and the lack of a strong legal system created a breeding ground for outlaws. Outlaws and gangs roamed free, taking what they wanted and living by their own code. They were the law unto themselves, feared by settlers and lawmen alike. These outlaws, they were a different breed. Hardened by the harsh realities of frontier life, they were ruthless and cunning. They were driven by greed, revenge, or just a plain disregard for the law. Bank robberies, train heists, and stagecoach holdups were their stock in trade. They were quick with a gun and even quicker to disappear into the vast wilderness. The rugged terrain provided the perfect cover for their escape, making it nearly impossible for lawmen to track them down. And among these hardened criminals, Billy the Kid rose to notoriety. His exploits became the stuff of legend, a symbol of the lawlessness that defined the era. He became a legend whispered in saloons and feared by lawmen. His name struck fear into the hearts of many, and his story continues to captivate the imagination to this day. Billy the Kid, he wasn't born with that name. In fact, his journey to becoming one of the most infamous outlaws in the American West began under a different identity. He was born Henry McCarty, later known as William Bonney. These names would become part of the legend that surrounded him. 
but they also tell the story of a young boy who had to adapt quickly to survive. But no matter what you call him, his life was marked by hardship from the get-go. Growing up in the mid-19th century was no easy feat, especially for a boy like Henry, who faced numerous challenges from a very young age. Born in New York City in 1859, Billy's early life was tough. The bustling streets of New York were filled with immigrants and working-class families struggling to make ends meet. Henry's family was no exception. He faced poverty and loss, forcing him and his family to head west in search of a better life. The promise of the West was alluring to many, offering the hope of new opportunities and a fresh start. But the West wasn't kind to young Billy. The harsh realities of frontier life were a far cry from the dreams of prosperity. The towns were rough and the people even rougher. He fell in with the wrong crowd, drifted into a life of crime. The lines between right and wrong were often blurred in the lawless territories, and for a young boy like Billy, the allure of quick money and the camaraderie of outlaws was hard to resist. He was just a teenager when he got his first taste of outlaw life. The thrill of the chase, the danger, and the sense of belonging to a group of like-minded individuals drew him deeper into a world from which there was no easy escape. Stealing, gambling, it wasn't long before he found himself on the wrong side of the law. The stakes were high, and the consequences of his actions began to catch up with him. Billy, he had a knack for survival. In a world where only the strongest and the smartest could thrive, Billy's quick thinking and adaptability set him apart. He was quick on the draw, a skilled horseman, and he had a certain charisma that drew people to him. His reputation grew and with it, the legend of Billy the Kid began to take shape. But his charm had a dangerous edge. Those who crossed him quickly learned that beneath his boyish exterior lay a fierce and determined individual. He was known for his temper and his willingness to use violence. Conflicts were often resolved with a gun, and Billy was not one to back down from a fight. By the time he was in his late teens, Billy the Kid was already a wanted man. His notoriety spread far and wide, making him a target for lawmen and bounty hunters alike. The young boy from New York had transformed into a symbol of the wild and untamed West, a legend that would endure long after his time. The American West wasn't just about gunfights and saloons, it was about land, cattle, and power. And in 1878, Billy the Kid found himself caught in the middle of a full-blown war. The Lincoln County War, they called it. A bloody feud between rival factions vying for control of the territory. Billy joined up with a group of cattle ranchers, fighting against a powerful group of businessmen who controlled the local economy. The war was a brutal affair. Shootouts erupted in broad daylight, and the body count rose with each passing day. During this conflict, Billy's reputation as a gunslinger grew. He was involved in several shootouts, proving himself to be a deadly shot. He was a wanted man with a price on his head. But he was also seen as a folk hero by some, fighting for the underdog against corrupt forces. Please like and subscribe for more adventures.